The second quarter of this year proved to be a positive one for the tourism sector. This was revealed by Chairman of the Barbados Hotel and Tourism Association, Roseanne Myers, during Friday's full meeting of the Social Partnership at Hilton Barbados. She said the improved performance was reflected in the central bank's review of the economy for the first half of the year. This showed that tourism value added increased by about 8.5% compared to 3.9% in the previous year. The last time we would have reviewed um, tourism performance, there was a lag obviously between the arrival numbers and what we were actually seeing in terms of tourism um, value added. I'm um, very pleased to see that in the last quarter, which coming into the summer months usually is expected to be a little bit weaker, we actually we did see an 8% growth. And I'm very pleased to see that that also tracks with the information that we're gathering. Um, I would have spoken about this concept or this new thing that we were seeing where you were seeing share shift from the traditional strong first quarter um, where we lost a little bit of ground in the um, luxury end, especially out of the UK market. And some properties did report that they were seeing people opting to wait until the rates drop to come April, May, June, and that actually has played out. So our latest um, STR statistics show that we did see an improvement in occupancies April, May, June over the same period last year, and the average daily rate, the ADR, has also seen an improvement in those three months. Um, it really brings us to the point where we need to, obviously as a private sector, work more closely with the um, central bank so that we can forecast what is expected in the future. And I think that that is something that we really have to commit as a social partnership to do because with all of the agencies, um, we need to be able to report